Hello mga ka-chefies! This is Chef Mom Rosebud. Welcome to my channel! Nako, I'm so excited today kasi isi-share ko sa inyo ang Langley's Honey Kitchen Series. O ba? Diba? Sabi ko nga, Langley's Honey Kitchen Series. So lahat ng recipes ko today, I will be using Langley's Honey. Tayong mga Pinoy kasi, when we say honey, we just commonly use it to sweeten our teas, our coffees, our juices, o minsan ginagamit rin natin to as a cough and cold remedy. Pero alam nyo ba, na marami pa ring uses ang honey bukod doon. Bukod sa ginagamit natin as a sweetener for our drinks, you could use it for your bread spreads, pwede rin yan sa ating mga cheeses, pang pancakes, pwede siya sa mga baking and cooking. O, ba? Diba? Pero alam nyo ba, na only Langney's has different variants to suit all of our needs. And Langney's enhances one's mood pag alam natin yung right variant that will complement our food. Hindi ko na patatagalin pa. Let's start! So for the first recipe, ang gagamitin ko ay ang ating Langney's Pure Bee Honey Golden Clear. Ayan. So this is the one that I'm gonna use. This one, ang color niya, as the name suggests, it's actually golden. And this is the sweetest among all the variants. This is perfect to sweeten your mga beverages, yung inyong mga coffee, tea, juices. Pero today, as you notice nga, or as I said, iba ang gagawin ko dito. Gagamitin ko siya for my honey cereal cup. So, I'll be needing 3 tablespoons of our golden clear. So, let me just open this. And I will be needing 3 tablespoons full. One, two, ayan o, very golden ang kanyang color. And three. So, I will be um, heating up all of the ingredients together dito sa ating saucepan. Pero mamaya, ibibake ko rin siya. That's why I already preheated the oven to 150 degrees um, Celsius. And I have here, I prepared our muffin tray with liner okay so this is something that you could prepare for your family sa mga kids nyo ayan so we just have here our butter so let's just melt our butter together with some brown sugar so melt it all there and now we'll be adding our Langney's Pure Honey Golden Clear. Ayan. Ang ating Langney's is actually 100% pure and natural honey. This is raw honey. It's unfiltered, it's unheated, and it is gluten-free and kosher as well. So let's just mix everything here in our saucepan. Ako ang bango na niya. There. And then we will mix the rest of the ingredients. So for this, we only need granola, some sliced or chopped almonds, and some dried fruit. So lagay lang natin siya lahat dito. And mix everything. And we have to work fast when we do this kasi magdidikit-dikit siya kaagad. And we have to place it in our muffin tray. So let's just mix everything. Ayan. Make sure that all of your ingredients are coated with the butter and the honey. There. So this is perfect for your breakfast. Pwede rin sa mga morning snacks. Of course, our kids are doing online school. So pag mga recess nila, pwede ito rin ang iserve. So just mix everything. This is good. I could turn off the heat now. There. So now, pwede na natin siyang ilagay dun sa ating muffin pan that is lined with a liner, with a paper liner. Let's go! So, lagay lang natin siya dito sa ating cupcake lined, ayan, muffin pan. So, working fast. Kasi nga magdidikit-dikit siya if we are slow. May hirap na siyang ilagay there. So, let's just fill all of the cupcake liner. Okay. So, we are done filling up our 
cupcake liner with our honey cereal mixture. And I will be baking this in the oven for around 10 minutes, again at 150 degrees Celsius. And I'm done with the first recipe in aking honey cereal cups using the Langley's Pure Bee Honey Golden Clear. O diba? Hindi lang siya pang beverage. Pwede rin siya sa mga itong dishes. Palalamigin ko muna to and then I will proceed to the next recipe. Stay tuned! Okay mga ka-chefies, now to my next recipe in aking honey strawberry pancakes. For this recipe, ang gagamitin ko naman ay yung Langley's BEC Akasha. So the Akasha is not too sweet or overpowering. This is perfect for mga early morning or afternoon snacks. This is perfect for your pancakes. Pwede rin to sa mga breads and spreads. Okay, so let's start. Pag samasamahin na muna natin yung ating mga dry ingredients, we have here the all-purpose flour. So I'm making the pancake from scratch. And then we have here our baking powder. So just put it there. Our cinnamon powder. Okay. And our salt. So just mix everything here. Sa ating bowl. And then we add in the wet ingredients. We have here our milk. Okay, just wet all of the flour and then we have here our oil and we also need one piece of egg there oops <laughs> okay and then of course our Langley's Be Easy Acacia Honey. So we're gonna be needing one tablespoon of our acacia honey here. At ang maganda dito, it comes in a squeeze bottle. Diba? So let's just get it. One tablespoon. There you go. So just mix it all there. Okay. And we will mix this all together to make the pancake batter. So like what I said, ang ating acacia honey is perfect for your pancake. So aside from me adding it to the batter, you could also drizzle your pancake with acacia honey, which I will be doing later. Okay, so let's mix na. There. And then we add in our sliced strawberries into the batter. Mmm. This looks so appetizing. Hindi ko pa naluluto eh. Natatakam na ako. There. So we will just be cooking this in a pan over some butter. Okay. So painitin na muna natin yung ating pan. And I have here our butter. So just make sure that you coat the bottom of your saucepan with butter. And swirl it around. Usually, when you make pancakes, I don't know if you noticed, the first batch, yung unang-unang pancake, medyo pumapalpak talaga. Maybe because the pan isn't hot enough yet. Tapos yung butter also, hindi pa masyadong coated yung ating pan. It happens. So, don't be afraid. Just keep on trying. Ang ating akasha honey, like what I said earlier, it's not too sweet and the taste is not too overpowering. When you actually try it, even on its own, parang ang feeling mo, you feel optimistic. Yung parang ganun ba? Na parang, I could take on anything today. Kaya perfect din siya sa mga ganito nga sa pancakes, mga waffles, pwede rin. Kalain nyo, di ba? Tayong kasi mga Pinoy, hindi natin alam na, ah, meron palang iba't ibang klaseng gamit ang honey. Hindi lang siya pang sweet na ating mga coffees and teas. Yeah, now you know. And like what I said earlier, only Langneys has different variants to fit all of our moods and needs. Okay? So, it's hot already. I have here a ladle. And go. 
So you could make big ones, you could make mini, it really depends on you. There. So, pag nalagay na natin yung batter na ating pancake, you just let the one side cook before you flip it to the other side. Hintay mo na natin maluto. You don't keep on moving it around. You don't keep on checking it because when you do that, mas masisira yung ating pancake. So let one side cook first and then flip it to the other side. Tapos ang masarap dito, di ba? Bukod dun sa ating strawberries na slice, meron ng acacia honey na nandun mismo sa batter. So can you just imagine the flavor of this pancake? Okay, this is good. We'll now flip it to the other side. There! See? So we'll just let that cook some more. And then of course, I'll continue with the rest of the batter. Diba? Medyo rustic ang ating pancake. Not a perfect circle, which is fine. Pero yung mga nabibili natin sa mga, yung mga, ang tawag doon, mga fast food chain, kaya sila perfect circle kasi meron naman silang mold. If you have that at home, feel free to use. Okay, this is good. Flip it to the other side. Oh, ha? Cooks fast. And then we'll continue with the rest of our pancakes. Yeah, you know that the pancake is already cooked if you can slide it like this now. Yung madali na siyang maslide. So that is fine. You could actually start flipping it already to the other side. There you go. Voila! So makikita nyo medyo may konting brownish color yung ating pancake. It's also because of the cinnamon. Kasi diba yung cinnamon powder is color brown. So this is good. Ipe-plate ko na siya. Balik tayo dun sa ating counter. done with the second recipe, ang aking honey strawberry pancakes using, of course, Langney's Be Easy Acacia Honey. So, natatakam na ba kayo? Meron pa akong third recipe in just a few. So, I'm on to the last recipe for today, ang aking berry banana smoothie. This time, using Langney's Black Forest Honey. This one has a low level sweetness and high intensity flavor which is perfect to enhance the flavor of your savory dishes and mild meats pero pwede rin to eat uh, drank as is it is actually a natural food supplement ito napakadali lang nitong recipe na to. all we have to do is put all the ingredients inside our blender so i have here our frozen strawberries if you want to use fresh strawberries you could also use that I have here frozen raspberries. Ito talagang frozen kasi wala naman tayong fresh dito. Correct me if I'm wrong, ha? pero alam ko wala. Okay. And then we're gonna be needing one piece banana. So let me just open this up. Lagay lang natin dyan. Diretso sa ating blender. And then we add in our milk. So perfect to for your breakfast. Dun sa mga tao dyan na hindi kumakain masyado for breakfast and they would just want to have a smoothie, this is perfect for you. And then we need our ice. At syempre yung pampasarap ng ating recipe, ang ating Langney's Black Forest Honey. So let me just open this. Kuha lang ako ng acting spoon. So let's just open that up. And let's get about one tablespoonful. Okay, diretso na tayo dito. Okay, so you could also adjust ha, if you want to make it a little bit more sweeter, then you could add some more of our black forest honey there. Close this and just blend it all together. Oh, this is good. Let's just get a handful of our basil. Lagay natin dyan. Can you imagine the flavor already? I'm sure... Medyo uh, nako-curious na kayo nung lasa nito. So, try this out at home, okay? Oh, 
Oh, this is good. Yummy, look at that. Perfect for your breakfast smoothie. Hmm. Ang sarap, parang na-energize talaga ako dito. Ah. So, syempre, pre-present ko sa inyo lahat ng dishes na ginawa ko today. Ayan na mga ka-chefies, I'm done with the episode today of Langney's Honey Kitchen Series. Nakagawa na ako ng honey cereal cups, ang ating honey strawberry pancakes, at ang aking berry banana smoothie. I hope that you enjoyed watching today's video. Sana naman ay may natutunan kayo today, o di ba? Ang Langney's can fit your every mood, o di ba? Pag meron kayong mga dishes dyan na kailangan ng perking up, just use Langney's. Kailangan lang ibaga yung variant na gagamitin nyo for your dishes. So, I hope that you enjoyed. Again, try to recreate this dish at home. This is available in all leading supermarkets. Available din siya sa Lazada, sa Shopee, sa Mercury Drug, at sa www.acemarket.ph So, huwag na kayo maghintay na kung ano pa. Bili na para magawa niyo itong mga recipes na. So, to, try ko muna itong honey cereal cups. Gamitan ko kanwari ng teaspoon. Pero kung walang nanonood, kagat lang to. Mmm! Perfect! I love the crunch. I love the flavors of all the nuts, the dried fruits, and of course, the honey really complements it well. Try ko naman itong honey strawberry pancakes. Using, of course, our acacia honey. Mmm, sarap. Grabe, ang sarap. Ang sarap. If you prepare this for your family, I'm sure mas mamahalin kayo nyo ng mga anak ninyo. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Thank you mga ka-chefies. I'll see you again next time for the next Langley's Honey Kitchen Series. Bye! Stay safe everyone! Kain muna ako. Hindi ko alam kung anong unahin ko. Okay.